A dramatic new development in a showdown between the city of St. Peter's and a homeowner over sunflowers. That homeowner was due to stand trial today, but here is Elia Davis with how the city's case wilted and tonight's you paid for it. I've been tracking this sunflower saga for months. St. Peter's accused Chris Bank of violating a city ordinance by having too many sunflowers in his yard in relation to the turf. The city admitted it never came on his property and took measurements. Still, the city was taking him to court. He was due to stand trial today, but instead of seeing the judge, he was directed to the St. Peter's prosecuting attorney. I was there as prosecutor Lorna Fromm told him St. Peter's was dropping the case. Chris, what's your reaction? Well, I'm not surprised really the way this entire thing has panned out. So it looks like uh, with no verdict and dismiss, it's a win. But it looks like we'll probably end up doing the same thing all over again next year. The prosecutor wouldn't go on camera but told me the sunflowers have been removed from the property and the property is no longer in violation and the city chose not to continue prosecuting the case. Sure enough, here's how Banks' yard looks now with the sunflowers gone. He says the cold weather wiped them out. Missouri State Representative Tony Lavasco from St. Charles County also came to the courthouse to support Chris Bank. Are you surprised that the city would pursue a homeowner to this extent over sunflowers? Uh, surprised? No. Uh, disappointed? Absolutely. I think uh, cities uh, generally take the position that uh, they can do what they can do and uh, they're going to make an example out of anyone who goes the other direction. I talked to the spokeswoman for the city of St. Peter's. And if he plans it next year, he could be prosecuted again. If somebody complains about it, then the process starts and we have to take it to where it goes. Uh, utterly insane. I figured there's so much other things out there that need to be addressed besides too many sunflowers. So while Chris Bank has won a victory against the city this year, He's not sure what he's going to face next spring when he again plants flowers in this yard, wondering if he'll have to fight the battle of the sunflowers all over again with St. Peter's. Of course I'll stay on top of this deal. After all, you paid for it.